Okay, so I wanted to talk about subliminal messages and rewiring your subconscious because I love talking about that subject. So, what did I do? I related homework that you get in school, high school, grade school, uh, elementary, junior high. I got that and I pretty much replicated it, but for subconscious rewiring, not wiring of school and math and history and science, not that learning, learning anything you want to learn. I pretty much made a a uh, I made a self test, a two page self test, where I write, "I am a hard worker." with a question mark at the end, because when you put a question mark at the end, it makes, it automatically makes your subconscious say, am I a hard worker? Then you write your answer, and your subconscious confirms it, and it completely bypasses your conscious mind, your frontal lobe, completely bypasses it. It's really cool, but you have to put a question mark at the end of every statement. That way, your subconscious will question it. It's weird because usually your conscious mind questions things. It says, wait, I don't know if I agree with that, but these will completely just gnaw into your subconscious. So I just wrote a bunch of them. My eyes are brown. No. And you answer, no, my eyes are not brown. My bones are breakable. No, my bones are unbreakable. Oops. I put no. Okay. And I'm using a pencil that way if I want to redo this again to even help more later on in the day, I can erase them and then rewrite them. That's not really needed though because I can just reread them. But I have ones that say I'm a hard worker and I put a yes. Yes, I am a hard worker. I am determined. Hell yeah. That's what I wrote. I never give up. Duh. Then you can write any answer. It's pretty much like what they do in school to us. They give us paper to work on in class, and we turn it in for a grade. We get praised. And you know what will also encourage your subconscious? If you write your own grade, like an A+, plus, on the paper. We are so hardwired from school that when we see a grade, it produces dopamine in our brains. If it's a good grade, we get dopamine. We get the reward hormone, the happy hormone, the pleasure hormone. We get that if we put an A plus on this after we do it. I printed up 10 of these. That way each day I can do one and then do it again until it's fast. So I'm getting subliminal messages in from audio, and, and I'm doing them on paper. So essentially, I'm doing what we were taught in school. We were talked to by our teachers of what to learn, and then we were given paper for homework and for classwork. Any grade you put on a piece of paper, you will still get slight amounts of dopamine in your brain, in your pineal gland, your pituitary. It will still activate, but the higher the grade you write on the paper, and especially if you put it in red pen or red marker or red sharpie, because red makes your brain show urgency and excitement and now. All different colors do all different kinds of things. If you look up psychology of colors or colors in marketing, you'll see that. But I've noticed for all my videos, like the past... I'd have to say four videos, I've been getting calmer in my videos. And not just that, I've been getting calmer in actual day life. Like, I can show some excitement, but I'm more calm. It's kind of cool. I like it. I encourage you to watch the video I made earlier of why you should buy a stuffed animal regardless of your age. 
And that shit showed up on the top of the search results right when I uploaded it. Head had no views and it was on top of the search results. Why? Here's a little tip. When you give a huge description, you're more likely to be at the top of the search results. I am actually on the first page, on the bottom, I'm on the last result, last result of buy a stuffed animal. You just type in buy a stuffed animal on Google or mostly YouTube and it shows up at the bottom of the page on the first page. Now if you type in the exact description or a little bit less of the exact description, I'm number one on the first page on the top. That's why it's good to study. SEO and marketing and how the internet works. So goodbye everyone. Like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Have a good day.